Hello and welcome to my SharePoint branding and design video blog. My name is Eric Swenson and you can visit my website at ericswenson.blogspot.com. You could also follow me at Twitter at Eric J. Swenson. Within this session we're going to be looking at Composed Looks, which is the new theming engine within SharePoint 2013. Here's an example of a basic team site, and it's pretty basic. There's not a lot of color to it. So what they allow is that you can click on this, what's your style. Um, you can choose a listing of predefined styles. So for this example, I can choose this one. Um, I can take the example defaults. I can then hit try it out. What it'll do is take a snapshot of my site with the design on top of it, and then if you like it, you can say yes, keep it. And then when you go back to your site, and you click on uh, your main site here, you'll see that you have uh, a lot of the things that have been changed. So it's a different master page, it's a different background, different colors and fonts. Um, so Maybe it's a little bit, um, maybe you want to make it a little bit different. You can go back into here and say, for example, uh, we want to change it to um, this item. And maybe we don't want this image here. It's a little bit blurry. So what we can actually do is take an example um, design that, uh, image that we've had before. And we actually maybe drag this picture of a beach directly on here and instantly what it'll do is it upload that image show it in the background we can then change the color scheme maybe to a more gray or something um, has a little bit more of a blue in it so maybe this item then here we can actually change the, uh, the master page so we'll look at something like this like a bell tab and then for the fonts, um, we can change it to um, sort of whatever font we want. So instead of Sago, we can have uh, Rockwell, or we can have um, Georgia. And once we're happy with that, we hit try it out. And then say yes to keep it. So here's an example of my site with my custom background with a beach. Um, the other way you can do it is under uh, settings, go to site settings. And then on the left here, under composed looks, here's a list of all of the, and you can't really see it that well with this color scheme, but um, this is really a list of all of the existing um, composed looks that you could then add your own and with your own style and then you can choose from the list. And that's pretty much a basic overview of the uh, composed looks. There's not a whole lot of um, you know, custom you know, design. You know, once you have your custom master page, then you can have your uh, custom style sheets, and then you can choose it from there. So thanks for watching.